That's the I team. United for Justice. That's Judge Cox, that's Chief Hyatt, that's Scott Schellenberger and the County Council. I'm a whistleblower in the courts and I'm asking for a grand jury before the 2020 elections. That's media invitation for Monday with me and Shelly, De La, Delegate Sheila Roof. Uh, and we're gonna talk about you too, the lady in the red dress. Last election we had the guy in the blue vest, the lady in the red dress. Both of y'all is political prostitutes because both of y'all just pimped the party. You pimped the Republicans and the man in the blue blood, he pimped the, Repub the Democrats. I'm a whistleblower in the courts and I want this perfectly clear. Alright? Who knows about this? So we're not leaving nobody out of that. I'm the Baltimore Block. Baltimore Block. Daniel Hellenberg. Van Hollen's office. Rob Fix. Megan Pringle. Kirk Smoke. Senator Mary Washington, Duckworth, Will Smith, Jeffrey Shorter. I want everybody. I'm a whistleblower on the courts and the corruption in the courts behind the war on drugs. I'm a whistleblower. That toilet I put in Towson was exposed in Scott Schellenberger, Greg Bernstein, and Governor O'Malley's mom machine. It was exposed in the gun task force in 2006. I contacted Governor O'Malley and told him I was making a movie. It's called Get Shorty. He just didn't know that the movie was about him. It's called entrapment. Y'all called me a terrorist. I'm a I'm an activist. And I told you I was an activist since 1986. It's about the war on drugs. So on February the 7th, 2011, y'all charged me with terrorism. You took all my evidence. You took all my property. I had to reshoot all the footage that you stole from me. I had to reshoot everything and do everything all over again. Well, I'm ready to go to court. I'm ready to do this before the 2020 elections. President Trump has this, the Secret Service has this, the Department of Justice has this. So anything that I say, I'm a whistleblower, and I'm expecting whistleblower protection from my state, city, county, and federal officials. On Monday at 2 p.m., me and Sheila Roof are going to have a sit-down. Everything that I got since 2006, I'm going to give it to Sheila Roof, and I'm going to put it on the table in front of the courthouse, right at Patriots Plaza. Scott Schellenberger, you're invited. Greg Bernstein, you're invited. Marilyn Mosby, you're invited. The press is invited because when I put that toilet out in front of the courthouse, y'all had a lot to say. I'm not locked up no more. I'm not locked up no more. I'm a free man. And my freedoms are on trial. And my public officials are supposed to, rep are, are supposed to protect my freedoms. You don't protect my freedoms, do your job or lose your job. Sheila Roof is going to do her job because these are the emails. So I want everybody on the same page. Because when I come up there, I don't want to get arrested. I get arrested, we go to court. We go to court, we take my cell phone to court. My cell phone has a Google account. So my Google account has everything on it since 2007. Everything since 2007. Google Drive, all that. You feel me? I'm not as dumb as y'all thought I was. I don't have no family here in Baltimore. I'm from Illinois. I'm from a place called Zion. A place you don't want to fuck with. I came here straight out of Illinois Department of Corrections. I'm a convict, N62528. I'm a cook. I'm a father. I'm an activist. So we're going to finish this right here. Monday, 2 p.m., Patriots Plaza. I am Dred Scott. Do blacks have rights in white America? We're going to find out. Like I said, these are all of your elected officials. That's Kiefer Mitchell. That's the county executive, Johnny Oleski. That's Tim Tennyson from uh, WBAL. That's Ken LaRue from Lake County. That's Eddie Conway. All right? That's Mary Washington. Y'all got this. Meeting for February, October 5th. Good morning. The mail I sent you is certified. You need to see it possible. Also, Jane Mellon and others. Also, contact Senator Antonio Hayes. All right? Hard copy. Thank you for what you do. All right? This is our response. Thank you. What time do you want to meet on Monday? I have a meeting at 11 to 1, so we can meet in the afternoon, maybe 2 p.m. Can you recommend a park, a convenient space where we can meet? All right. See the meeting? See who got this? Johnny Oleski, Tim Tennyson, Kiefer Mitchell, Ethics Commission, Gene Walisky, Julian Jones. You see that? Delegate Sheila Ruth, thank you for at least hearing me, all right? I'll be waiting for your response for a meeting location. Looking forward to catching up. See that? Megan Pringle.
All right. This is my response. Her response. Thank you for your suggestion. I did finally receive your storyboard. We can meet at Patriot Plaza in Towson. The square is outside between the courthouse and the old courthouse where the government offices are. I'm not prepared to meet with Chief Hyatt Scott Schellenberger at this time. I just wanted a chance to meet with you so I can hear the full story and better understand the situation. I put a toilet in front of the Towson Courthouse on Super Bowl Sunday, February the 6th. Baltimore County Police and Baltimore Towson Police Department seen me do it. You locked me up 36 hours after I did it, 2 p.m. on Monday, because I was headed to Las Vegas to sell this story about Baltimore, the money you make off black bodies, the war on drugs. I told y'all when I came here, dog, I'm a hustler. I make money off of, I make money, money don't make me. The game is to be sold, it ain't to be told. That's why I made the story about Baltimore. I'm a drug dealer, an ex-offender. I'm a criminal. Yeah, all these things that you hate, I was. But all the things that you love, I am. I'm a man. I'm a free black man. I'm a free black man in America fighting for my freedom. And I want what belongs to me. I'm out $2.6 million in lost wages. I need a federal and state audit on 111905 Falls Road from 2000 and seven back to 1997 and then i need an order for 2008 because no money was paid money was made but no money was paid jake davis james hammond brother insurance bank of america and sun trust bank participated in fraud scott schellenberger greg bernstein judge janae judge papaya judge souter judge kavanaugh participated in fraud y'all owe me y'all gonna pay me by any means necessary. Ain't no stick up without a gun. I'm going to beat you in court the way that you tried to beat me in court. I'm going to take your money. You feel me? I don't have to sign a gag order, a dissent decree, because Baltimore County ain't under the dissent decree. But Chief Hyde is out there, and Chief Hyde is a witness to this. Anything I say, I can back up. My paperwork is in order. Them emails is a paper trail. It's going to send some people to jail, because I didn't commit no crime. I was kidnapped. That's a criminal offense. My property was stolen. That's a criminal offense. Do you understand? I don't need a million people to march. I need a million people to pay attention. And I'm selling this shit to Netflix. You thought Tiger King was slick? What you gonna do when they sell all these motherfuckers to jail in Baltimore City and Baltimore County? What you gonna do when I shame these motherfuckers the way that y'all tried to shame me and disrespect me and my family? Dog, you don't never see me fight with nobody. I ain't never asked nobody to fight my fight. Because when I come in the room, I know how to fight. I stand my ground. When I holler, Mike, check! You shit your drawers. I shut you down. So today, handle your business. Monday, 2 p.m., be at the courthouse. You want to know the truth? Truth going to speak to power. And my paperwork going to be on the table. And anybody got a problem with me, holler at me. Charge me with a crime other than being black in America. Because I'm going to charge you with them crimes of theft kidnapping, using your political powers for, for personal and financial gains, racketeering and fraud in the court. Google Operation Greylord. That's my blueprint. I'm going to make a dollar out of 15 cents. Check yourself.